Listen to Rock the Walls with Patrick Walford, Saturdays 8 to 10 p.m. Eastern, only on Adobe Radio. Hey guys, what's up? Patrick Walford here with you, host and producer of Rock the Walls and IW Radio, Saturdays from 8 until 10 p.m. IWRadio.com if you want to go and check that out. On this week's show, we're going to be having I Russell Bear once, the Swellers and Dead and Divine on the show if you want to check that out as well. Some exclusive Inside the Music segments with some really cool bands. So you can check it out Saturdays, 8 to 10 p.m. on IWRadio.com. This video is obviously about the big Double Wars Prada Fall 2 announcement that I've been sitting on for about the past week. A lot of people have been wondering why I couldn't just come out and plain as day announce it. It's uh, due to the fact that one of the bands on that bill is playing my city in particular, Toronto, today. I didn't want to affect that band's draw in this city, a lot of respect for that band, so uh, I decided to hold out until the day of that they're playing because I would figure a lot of kids uh, already have their tickets to the Toronto show. So uh, if you can put the piece together in a couple seconds here, you're going to be able to figure out this tour really quickly. But otherwise, we're going to throw it to this band and uh, they're going to tell us uh, all about this tour and who's on it. So. Definitely go and check that out as well. We have some audio from some of the bands on the set bill kind of explaining what the tour is uh, exactly dates wise as far as when it's going to be and uh, how long it's going to be afterwards. So uh, definitely stay tuned till the end of the video. So here it is, an update with the opener of the second band on this tour. Hey, this is Brandon. I play bass in four today. So uh, coming up after this tour, um, what exactly you guys have planned? Are you guys going to be writing anything like that anytime soon? Yeah, we got about two and a half months off, and then we're going to be working on uh, writing a new, new album. We already have about five and a half songs done, and got a few more to write. And then, um, yeah, we're doing a tour with uh, Devil Wars Prada and Whitechapel in uh, November, December, and then we're going to be recording a new album in January. So, yeah. And, and with that, this this being your guys' fourth release at this point, I mean, your last record, Breaker, I, I think you guys would probably agree to, you guys pretty much blowing up as soon as that record came out, more or less. So, I mean, going into this record, knowing that you guys have a, a lot bigger of a fan base from Breaker, what kind of approach are you guys kind of taking in the writing process? Um, I think we're just kind of trying to go for just sort of the same kind of sound. I think we know kind of what our fans expect from us and what we figured out kind of what people like about our band and just try to kind of do more of that and... Uh, I don't know, just keep it kind of like the catchy vocal parts and sing-alongs and stuff like that. And um, I don't know, just kind of more of the same, I guess. Not, I mean, changing enough, but not too much, I guess. Yeah, you guys more or less know what your fan base is at this point, what they what they like more or less. Yeah. Now, as, as far as it goes within the writing process for you guys, is it something that Maddie does specifically by himself, or do you guys all work together to write the lyrics? Um, for the lyrics, it's Maddie just does all that. We like me and Ryan, my brother. He plays guitar in the band, and we write all the music pretty much, and we'll record demos of it and send it to Maddie, and he'll work on lyrics and put his vocals over it and stuff like that after we're done writing stuff. Now, with that kind of standpoint that you guys take doing it that way, as far as when it comes to writing things like breakdowns and stuff like that for you guys, uh, just with the amount of bands, I mean, you almost look at like a tour like All Stars tour where pretty much every band plays breakdowns for you guys and kind of. Knowing that there's obviously, that's kind of the in thing now with metalcore music being so popular. For you guys to try and keep it fresh, what do you guys really feel you need to do on this release to kind of surpass Breaker and uh, kind of move forward? I don't know. Some, well, sometimes Maddie will have like a, a catchy hook for a breakdown and we'll, we'll just try to like, try to make whatever works best with, best with all the, the vocals and everything. And uh, I don't know, just kind of look at the song as a big picture and not just like making a cool part but making a part that works well with the vocals too so so kids can like catch on to it easy and sing along and stuff like that because I think that's what makes our live shows better and whenever our live shows better more people are going to come see us and you know. yeah. and any any ideas for as a producer yet or you guys uh, don't know just yet who you guys going to be going with yeah we're going to go uh, the machine shop with Will Putney again the same place we recorded our last album so yeah he did a great job and I don't know we're really happy with that so we're going to go back with him are you guys probably expecting to record that release it by summertime maybe hop on something like Warp Tour next summer I think it'll probably come out around spring I would think and then I think we'll, we'll probably do a headliner in the spring and I'm not really sure what we have after that um, Hey I'm Rory I play guitar uh, I'm Chris I'm the bassist there's uh, some touring plans coming up. You guys are going to be doing a headliner with uh, your buddies in Your Demise and Let Live in the UK. As far as uh, some plans over here uh, in the fall of 2011, are you guys going to be doing anything? Are you guys going to kind of wait until uh, the record drops early next year? Um, we're going to wait until it drops to do our actual headline tour. So that'll be um, uh, early next year. But we are coming out to North America in um, like November doing like a six week tour. Then we can't tell you who we're, but it's just a support slot. But that'll be announced pretty soon. 
There you have it guys, the Devil Wars Prada is going to be doing a fall headline tour in November and December, a six week long tour with Whitechapel for today and Enter Shikari as support. As far as the second and first slot goes, I'd probably have to say you're going to see four today in the second slot. Enter Shikari in the first slot, I, four today is killing it out there right now. So it was Enter Shikari, but I think in terms of popularity over here, uh, four today has got a bit of an edge on them. They'll both be playing 30 minute sets regardless, so it's not that big of a deal. Make sure you get to those shows early. And make sure you check these bands out. They still have a couple dates left on each of their respective tours this summer. Whitechapel's on Summer Slaughter Tour, which, as I mentioned before, is coming through Toronto today. Um, go and check out the rest of the dates on that tour. A bunch of amazing metal bands that are out. Uh, just an incredible package. Devil Wars Prada and Etrus Curry are on the last week of Warp Tour uh, into the West Coast. And then you have for today, about two weeks left on their All Stars Tour run. Check out all the dates for that. If not, you guys got to wait about three months until you get your brains blown out whenever these bands hit your town. I'm definitely looking forward to that. And of course, for today with a brand new record, going back with Will Putney. Definitely didn't expect those guys to be back in the studio as soon as they are, but very much looking forward to that record. And hopefully we'll see them on a tour like Warp Tour next summer. It uh, should be sweet. Go and follow me over on Twitter, twitter.com slash rockthewalls, and like our page over on Facebook, facebook.com slash rockthewalls for exclusive music news, tour announcements just like this one, interviews, and much, much more. And check out our show, Rock the Walls, this Saturday from 8 until 10 p.m. on adoberadio.com, featuring interviews with I Russell the Bear once, The Swellers, and Dead Divine. Really stoked on the show. Have a bunch of other really cool stuff that I'm going to be showing on the show. But otherwise, guys, thanks a lot for checking it out. Tell your friends about the page, all that fun stuff, and I'll talk to you later.